Hello folks. Today I'm unboxing my new waders I got on Amazon. Let's take a look at these. It's a brand I haven't heard of. And I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to open the box to read the brand name. But they were a good price. I think they're like under a hundred bucks. So and I, I'll get the actual pricing. So these are waders, they have boots built into them. Let's take a look. They did a really good job packaging this up. Gotta be careful with this knife so I don't screw up the the waders. I'm just using a, a kitchen knife. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna put this down first. So I'll hold these up in a second man. Okay, the brand is Comex, K-O-M-E-X. I don't even know if I'm saying it right. They're made in China. And I bought a size 11 boot. They look like, they're, they're breathable waders. And they have, um, I like that they have this belt loose for the, the belt that came with it. It's just a standard lockable, clickable belt. So, um, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn off the camera and try these on and, uh, and then I'll turn it back on and let you know how they fit. Stay tuned. Hi, I'm back. I have these waders called Comex, K-O-M-E-X. And uh, these have the boots built into them, as you can see the boots, they're built in. They're breathable waders. Um, and uh, I don't know if I got the right size. The I'm a size 10 and a half shoe. I got the 11 boots, so the boots feel fine. Um, I don't have a lot of range of motion. Like my leg, I can only put my leg up this high. I don't know if I need to exchange these. This is the highest I can go. Uh, or range range of motion. I can't bring my knee up, you know. If I sit down, I can I can sit down, but it's very tight in here. Um, I may need to ask about getting a bigger size or something like that, a longer size. Uh, I'm six feet tall. Um, what I like about these waders is. They uh, have these belt loops for your belt, right here. And then it has a drawstring to draw this up tighter. You can just tuck that in. There's a pocket right here. Um, usually these pockets have magnets. This one doesn't have a magnet, but it's it, it closes quite easily though. Um, and uh, no other pockets on here, but they're they're waiters, and um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna ask about uh, a bigger size, and I'll get back to you uh, with some more information uh, because my other waiters had more range of motion. Okay, so welcome back. We're at the beach. We're at Delray Beach, uh, the seaside, and there's a little bit of surf coach fishing. Uh, mostly, I'm here to test out these chest waiters. Um, so I looked up the price again. I, I, I completely forgot how much I paid for these. I, I remember they were cheap. They were 35 bucks. Um, and my Amazon Prime shipped them for free with a, with a bunch of other stuff. Uh, so uh, in the last video, I didn't really, I, I forgot the price, but they're, they're $35 on Amazon. Uh, made in China called Comtex. Comtex was the name of the, uh, the, the chest waders. I had another pair of chest waders also with the boots um, before, and I spent over a hundred dollars on them. 
and they leak. So I'm going to go test these out today and see if they leak. So stay tuned. I'll give you an update uh, as soon as I get back. And maybe I'll, I'll catch the surf at some point too. Stay tuned. What is it, honey? This is a uh, red tail surf perch. So, so I was out testing these waders. Uh huh. And these waders work great. Thirty-five dollars, Comtex, on Amazon. Um, and I also got into a surf perch. Finally got a bite here. You got to move around a lot on Delray Beach. Um, but this is one. But then I forgot. <laughs> I forgot my uh, my creel where I could put my, my, my fish in. It's a little bag, so I just brought it up here. But anyway, this video is about testing these waders. Um, they're comfortable. Uh, the, the, the boots are really comfortable. Um, I'm wearing I'm wearing a very thin slip uh, uh, footy sock, uh, and I'm not cold at all. Of course, this kind of warm right now um, but uh, these waders are holding up really well and, um, and the fish are biting so life is good if this video is helpful for you on waders or catching surf perch and I'll do some more videos on surf perch as well please like and subscribe thanks okay this My... is a surf perch uh -huh. I yeah. caught this on a, uh, a homemade rig with um, it looks like it bit my number my number four size bait hook. It's an eagle claw bait hook, uh, bait called bait holder number four. Um, here I have three hooks rigged up with um, Berkeley Power Worms. People ask me why do you use three hooks, and I tell them it's because I can't use four. Uh, more is better, right? So anyway, uh, down here at Delray Beach, it's a long beach. I think it's like seven miles of beach and I had to move around a lot to catch this one fish. Um, and then I forgot my creel. So I, I had to come back up to the, the truck to get my creel and, and then um, we'll put this fish on ice. Hopefully I can catch a couple more before the end of the day and, and have some dinner. Anyway, like and subscribe if this was helpful for you and I'll see you on the water. Big one! It's a big one! That's a keeper. Yeah, it's a keeper. Hold it! Good.
throwing back.